good morning friends uh, this is the end of the video about uh, us bank collapse is very interesting news uh, in the sense that uh, lot of dependencies uh, between the bank and a lot of other countries people working throughout the world for this bank uh, like that way a lot of outsourced uh, employees are there i mean uh, their, their works have been outsourced throughout the world and lot of people working there and uh, in that sense it is very interesting okay uh, <coughs> so uh, so thank you for liking sharing subscribing and keeping the spirit of channel up this is uh, and uh, welcome once again so let us discuss what is happening I and mean, last few weeks what have been two weeks i think so what happened was uh, uh, around five banks in us collapsed uh, among this was uh, one was a cryptocurrency bank due to the it failed due to uh, the cryptocurrency bank uh, market issues i mean it was falling and so they couldn't keep up and it was so it second one was the silicon valley bank where the startups have a very interest uh, invested uh, even though they were giving very low interest rates uh, one of the main reasons was that they invested uh, the bank itself invested in government bonds that was giving very 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 little interest and the customers invested in the bank was getting very uh, minimal interest on that and so what happened was actually this is a cyclical process and the customers at point and us actually decided to increase the share, increase the bond value i mean the uh, in the rates of bonds uh, and that actually couldn't the bank couldn't actually uh, give the value back so there was uh, the customers were feeling they, they were uh, they were into the fixed deposit were not valued properly and they withdraw the money like that that's the that's second reason was actually they sold around uh, 2.5 billion worth of shares the bank silicon valley bank and that actually led to panic withdrawal uh, they these two actually contributed equally to the fall of the bank the third one was a signature bank actually uh, mean mainly is of withdrawal of large amount of money okay because the uh, silicon valley bank was collapsing and they withdraw a lot of money and it, that also led to the failure the credit suisse was actually trying to save the customers by making a deal with ubs and uh, that also actually uh, finally failed uh, the third the fourth the fifth one actually is the uh, first republic bank uh, that also actually panicked totally Uh, so uh, three of the banks failed uh, you can see that three of the banks failed due to panic withdrawal and uh, credit suisse was planning i mean they actually informed they were actually expecting that for last one years and preparing for that i mean through acquisition by ubs like that so uh, so from all these things uh, you may uh, understand that uh, with the panic withdrawal actually contribute Uh, for loss of your money uh, if there is you want a small chance for the bank survival then you will get your money back uh, there there is if you are actually going and withdrawing money like mad uh, madness now uh, then you are actually going to lose your money or your, your money may get locked up for at least more than 5 or 10 years there is the possibility like that and uh, the bank will get liquidated It, it, there is a, a lot of possibility like that so be better option is uh, don't go uh, don't uh, let yourself into any type of finance uh, it is actually, it may be actually a lot of news may be going uh, wrong news i mean uh, it just uh, what you can say hyperactive news or you can say viral news uh, there is no meaning in that so uh, be careful while withdrawing panic withdrawals don't go with the wind it may actually make your uh, what uh, investments fail banks fail economies fail 
and uh, actually uh, two of the banks that is the silicon valley bank and credit suisse uh, very very big um, um, employers maybe they were together maybe employing around 80000 people i think throughout the world very well large invest i mean uh, i lot of it investments i a lot of people invested in it mm, and uh, i mean I, I people from it invested in that uh, especially the startups in the silicon valley bank it was very big concern uh, with uh, because uh, they did not know how to get their money back from the bank on time whether they whether they will be able to pay their employees or uh, their creditors on in time like that so uh, all these things taking all these things into concern uh, maybe you us may be able to correct what was going wrong from their side they are trying to correct it and uh, i hope uh, it will not happen again so panic uh, withdrawal doesn't help anything so yes to all uh, so uh, be steady with your investments in the bank and uh, you, even if you bid around uh, 10 20% uh, at this time it will not be a very very, very big problem don't bid go and bid all all lot of money and that will actually uh, doesn't help in any situation uh, thanks for watching guys and uh, so you may be thinking why we discussed all these things yeah there is a lot of implications throughout the world people throughout the world may be losing their uh, jobs because of i mean bank related dpos and other things that may be that is also throughout the world will be losing their jobs uh, as expected a uh, lot of people be losing their jobs and uh, so be careful people who uh, work on dpo and banking sector uh, can be careful on that uh let us enter the day uh I wish you all a good day good morning uh, thanks for watching please like share subscribe comment and keep the morale of the channel up thank you very much